So this is Combo and today we are driving to the Hokiza in Masi Fumilele. So this is Philip and Philip will explain us a little what it is all about. Oh, yeah. Cool. So this house is the first house um, that was built and opened um, in 2002 on the 1st of December, which is World Age Day. Um, so this house is now for the young children uh, from the age 11 down one. So we take children from birth up until 18. I'll also show you the teenage house we'll be done in this house. So this is just our kitchen. So as child and UK workers, we do our own cooking, we don't outsource any catering. We do our own cooking, we do our own cleaning, just like a normal um, household. So we try also to teach the children, you know, about the duties as the mother and the father. So as, also as men, we do cooking, we do change nappies, we do cleaning. There's no women and, and, and men's um, uh, uh, work. We all do it as like, just like a normal family. Um, so in here, we just our study room. This is where the children uh, do their homework when they come back from school. So we try to make it um, as much as quiet as possible. It's sometimes impossible, you know, with the children also, you know, playing and running around. You know, playing is very good for the children. So we don't want to deprive them from playing, but also respect those who are uh, busy doing their work here. Um, in here is our therapeutic room, which is for one-on-one um, -on -one sessions with the children. Um, this is mostly for children who are young, who cannot, um, 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 you know, express verbally, you know, like their feelings, their emotions. Um, so we use this space, you know, to communicate with them, you know, um, as you can see, you know, some um, tools, toys here, you know, that we can use to communicate with them, you know, we've got dolls, we've got um, 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 different animals, different puzzles that we can also communicate with them so that we can um, uh, tell whether the child is happy, are they sad, also depending, you know, sometimes depending on the colors that they normally choose, that will tell you whether the child is happy or are they uh, sad. Um, and also just to communicate if they've got any issues that they will need to communicate to you. And then we also make reference to the um, um, you know, qualified um, play therapist so that they can address the issues if we pick up any issues from you know the sessions that we have in this in this room so this is basically for one-on-one -on -one when you can give a child some time one-on-one -on -one so that they can communicate with you but sometimes it's very difficult for a child to communicate in a group mm. so that's why we um we, we use this um, little room here um so yeah okay okay wir sind wir in der babystation aktuell hat hukisa keine babys sie sind aber jederzeit darauf vorbereitet dass babys hier aufgenommen werden können ich habe gerade erfahren, dass ähm, ein Baby, was von einer HIV-positiven Mutter geboren wird, nicht unbedingt selbst AIDS ähm, bzw. HIV-positiv ist. Das Problem ist, ähm, dass die stillenden Mütter ähm, durch das Stillen HIV übertragen. Das heißt, es ist ganz wichtig, dass Hokisa ähm, darauf achtet, dass die Kinder gefüttert werden und nicht an der Brust ähm, äh, der Mutter ernährt werden, um eben nicht auch ähm, positiv zu werden. So, der Philipp hat mir jetzt gerade den Computerraum der Schule gezeigt. Hier gibt es drei Arbeitsplätze für die Kinder, wo sie online gehen können. Und genau wie bei uns in Deutschland ähm, äh, werden hier die gefährlichen Webseiten gesperrt. Die Einrichtung ähm, hat eine Strategie entwickelt ähm, und bringt den Kindern auch entsprechend bei, welche Seiten gefährlich sein können und ähm, welche Seiten man besuchen kann. So, das hier ist ein Zimmer von zwei Jungs, die neun und elf sind. Ich habe gerade von Philipp erfahren, dass ähm, hier in der ähm, Gegend Alkoholismus eine große Rolle spielt. Ähm, diese beiden Jungs zum Beispiel haben Eltern, die den ganzen Tag trinken und ähm, teilweise ihre Kinder zu Hause eingeschlossen haben. Es gibt hier Streetworker, die in den Townships unterwegs sind und die dann eben die ganz besonders krassen ähm, Fälle ähm, äh, in Einrichtungen wie diese bringen, wenn sie eben sehen, dass irgendwo ähm, Hilfe ganz dringend benötigt wird. Hier sind wir jetzt in einem Zimmer, wo zwei Mädchen wohnen. Hier haben sie ihren Kleiderschrank, zwei Betten 
Und wenn die Kinder hier ankommen, dann wird erstmal geschaut, welche Klamotten sie haben, was noch benötigt wird. Und dementsprechend wird dann alles ergänzt. In Südafrika haben die Kinder übrigens in den Schulen immer eine Schuluniform an. Das kommt wohl noch von den Engländern. So, I'm now sitting together with um, Philip and um, he showed me around. My impression is that Hokisa is doing a very important um, job here for this community. My impression is also that um, uh, all the children who are living here at the moment, um, uh, 15, are treated with respect. And um, I was impressed that you um, call them your children yes, and yes. you um, <laughs> just told me you have uh, many children and they call you um, daddy. So um, uh, only around 10% of the income is coming from the South African government. So mm -hmm. um, this um, project really relies on um, uh, your support, on the Schiller support mm -hmm. and um, coming from many other um, um, countries and, and so on. So um, thank you very much, um, Philip, for showing me around. I'm yes. um, impressed by, by this project. It's, it's an absolute pleasure and, um, you know, thank you um, to all of you um, uh, 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 at the, the school and um, the whole community. Um, if you remember some of me, some of you will remember me. I visited in 2018 um, the likes of Simon, 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 yes, I met. Um, and, and really your support goes a long way. Um, you know, it, it encourages us to, to keep on doing the, the work that we're doing. Like I just was just um, I, I'm saying that, you know, we, we call ourselves uh, the mothers and the fathers of the children, these children, although they're not our biological children. You know, we also go to school meetings where they call um, us or they are their fathers. And like I was making it a joke that, you know, they think they've got so many children which I'm very happy to hear <laughs> because at the end of the day they are, you know, they are, they are my children indeed because I, I'm, I'm, I have to work with them every day. And um, we also try to give, an, to make an example that, you know, how a normal family can live, like a father and a mother can live. So we also do our own cooking. I do cooking one day, if you come, I'll cook for you. <laughs> um, we also do the cleaning ourselves, just like a normal home as well. Like our children also have chores. Uh, that they also do as a life skill, you know, like cooking chores, mopping chores, you know, um, uh, those kind of skills that they also use when they are now uh, older. Um, yeah, that's 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 all Kisa. That's all Kisa yeah. for you. And 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 to be honest, none of this could have been um, uh, possible if it wasn't for support um, uh, of people like you, you know, who go an extra mile, who take that initiative to do fundraising which is not an easy easy thing, believe me. Yeah. I've been there, I've, I've, I've seen, and I've seen um, how amazing, you know, you know, you know the, the school children and the teachers and the parents, you know, come together, you know, to, to fundraise uh, uh, for projects like Okisa. And um, yeah, to, from the bottom of my heart, yeah. I really thank you. Running was not an easy job for the children in Cologne. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, I, it's a lot. I brought some sweets and of course the banner. Many greetings from sunny South Africa. It's very sunny. The weather's <laughs> beautiful today. A little bit windy, but yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> we hope to see you some other time. I hope you'll visit. Um, keep yeah. well. Keep well. Yeah.